All right, Cell, are you ready? Yeah, I am. Okay. Describe your relationship to each other in three words. Three will be. <laughs> You're too lucky. <laughs> What'd you write? I wrote mum in American writing, M O M, oh, best friend and soulmate. How cute! I wrote fun, loving, and unpredictable. <laughs> What's our next question, daughter? Who is a messier roommate? That's a really hard uh, question. What was it? <laughs> <laughs> Who's the more stubborn roommate? <laughs> that one's easy. <laughs> <laughs> Yay! <laughs> you think I'm stubborn too? She so embraces it. <laughs> Who takes the longest to get ready? What would you write? We both <laughs> equal. I said it depends, but probably me. I think I take longer in the morning before That's true. practice. But I can't decide what to wear. She will change her outfit. I kid you not, at least four or five times. She always ends up with the first <laughs> outfit. I'm like, oh, okay, so it took us an hour to get to where we were in the first place. <laughs> Who has the better toe point? Can we, do we need to write it down still? <laughs> the next question. What is it? Who is the more dramatic roommate? Oh, yeah, I know who it is. <laughs> she's more dramatic. I'm still dramatic, but that's why I'm smaller in writing. She's small in writing, but she says to me the other day, she goes, why are you so dramatic, Stella? <laughs> Who's the better cook? We all know the answer. Come on, the whole team knows the answer. <laughs> also, Stella doesn't cook so true. <laughs> I'll make cereal. You cook sometimes. And then she'll have it for a week, and then that's her cooking for the month. <laughs> for the month or longer. As we're both international, who gets the most homesick? Go. One. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to see. Wait, one, two, three. If I had to say someone, it would say Stella. It would say Stella. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not an English major, okay? I don't get homesick anymore because I have you. Yeah. Aww. <laughs> like if I'm like feeling sad or something, I'll just like. That's true. It's like go to Peng's room. When you first came here, yeah. she was really. You were yeah. just like you were really homesick. Yeah. When I came too, I was really homesick, but she didn't know I didn't me. Know her but now really we have cool. each other, so it's yeah. fine. Who is more American? American? Yes. What did you write? <laughs> <laughs> I said none of us we embrace our country. <laughs> oh, countries. There we go. Is it a muggle? Muggle? What? I'm from three different places. No, you're a mutt. <laughs> <laughs> a muggle is a non-wizard. You're not a wizard, <laughs> Harry. When was the first time you met? 2015 when I first came to LA. I said in the gym and I'm pretty sure I rolled my ankle too. The summer of 2015. <laughs> so I came into the gym and she was just running around on the floor and then she all of a sudden does a side aerial and Literally, I was in so much pain. I thought I was on about to floor. puke. And I was supposed to take her somewhere, because I was supposed to show her around. Yeah. And she was going to come with me, and we were going to go drive. And it was loud. Like, I don't know. I thought you broke it, your toe. I thought I broke something. <laughs> then after that, literally was history. Well, after that was history, Just we bullet. went. We had some food. I'm not going to say what we had. It was Diddy Reese. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for playing. How do you feel like you guys did? Okay, I wrote that first. You actually? Yes. Maybe we should get married. <laughs> well, I guess neither of us can get us a green card, so that, that won't work. Yeah. Good job, Stella. <laughs> Yay. Yay. I love you. I love you too.